All right, guys, today we're working on a uh, Lenovo IdeaPad U310, and I'm going to show you how to upgrade from a conventional hard drive to a Samsung U, um, what is this, an 840 series a low profile hard drive. It's a solid state disk. And uh, you would need to remove the cover, which does void the warranty on the unit, so that's something to keep in mind. Um, you can check out my other video on how to remove the bottom cover. Now, uh, in order to remove the hard disk drive, you do need to unplug the battery, which is right here. Use two fingers to pry it away from the system board. You're going to want to remove screws here, 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 and here. I removed three already, make it quicker. Once you have those screws removed, you're going to want to pull the connector, get in your fingernail, kind of in here, pull the connector away from the disc. You're going to want to remove four screws around it, around the tray. Here's the old disc. Here's the new one. Trick is getting these in there. I'm just going to put two in for now and go ahead and reconnect the connector and push it back in there. You would want to put the four screws back in. One other step though, you have your um, solid state disc that's uh, in a different connector on the motherboard. Now uh, you would want to remove this as this is designed to work in conjunction with a regular hard drive. Now you may be able to keep it in but I prefer to actually remove this one. And just leave that aside and run straight off the solid state. Now that's part of the I think it's I believe it's called Intel Rapid Start technology which you don't really need if you have the solid state disk. So you would need to reinstall your operating system. I'm going to use Windows 7 on this one. But uh, that's pretty much it.